Welcome back, fam, to another video. We out here, sign that like, comment, share, and subscribes. Uh, speaking of subscribes, let's just get it out of the way, baby. This whole week, we're just going to be pushing to get a 1,000 subscribers to our second channel. I'll put the information down below, a little clickable link, the name. Go ahead. If we can get a 1,000 of you guys to go over there and subscribe, the sooner the better. I don't know how long it's going to take because it's a new channel. But let's get it going. Uh, we have a trip coming up real soon that uh, will be kind of the jumpstart of that channel over there. And we'll talk about that more a little bit uh, in the video. Also, this is free food week. So essentially, we are emptying now all our reward points on all the apps, and we're enjoying some good good. So these cookies right here, baby. These cookies right here. Como se dice? A free a nine nine. Okay, let's shut up and eat. All right, there's a, lot, a little bit of sun action here. What's going on? A little bit of sun. That's okay. Hopefully that doesn't bother you guys as much as it's bothering me right now. Okay, so if you haven't already, make sure you guys download the Crumble app because, uh, man, when I tell you, like, those Crumble Cash points add up, they add up, baby. Also, they add up fast, and they also give you a bunch of different points uh, to, like, share on their, uh, to follow their Twitter X, to follow them on Instagram, to follow. Before you know it, you could probably get a quick... Uh, 100 points which equals to ten dollars you can get a free like ten dollars like just off the jump so make sure you download that all right so these are my picks for this week right here uh you guys saw them uh there was one that was kind of a um a uh what you call it a uh uh like a curveball one and i was like man i that you know i can only fit four in here um but that's okay all right so we're gonna go down the row here and we're gonna start from this guy right here you guys can see so this one right here real basic this is what we call la basic got a little shadow there from uh, from the glare but this is the maple cream it's uh vanilla shortbread and obviously a maple cream cheese right there nice little sandwich action i recommend probably getting this with a actually hold on one two three four yeah i recommend getting one of these and just a tall glass of milk man and you just go, go to town down that chair See in my mind, get closer. In my mind, it almost feels like it's ice cream, but I know it's not ice cream. But it's damn delicious. Some of y'all saying loop, that's basic, and it is. But there's two types of basics, the good type of basics and the bad type of basics. That, my friend, is the good ones. All right. You know, Crumble Crumble's coming out the gate. They, they're they trying new things. I don't know what they're going to do next, probably. I've been trying to tell them for a while. Why don't you guys make, like, um, uh, dog cookies, man? I'm telling you. People that have rescues or have dogs, like, we would buy that up. We would buy that more than we would buy these or we would get those in these and make it a little treat day. So this is some of the new stuff that they got going on. I'm waiting for them to do like crumble flavored ice cream too. I feel like that might be down the down the situation too. Sorry about the glare there, but at least you guys are getting some of that, that sun action on there. You guys see how thick it is? And this I believe is an extra, when you order this, which is basically a, a freaking cake, you, I think it's like an extra 50 cents or an extra dollar or something like that. But yeah, we're going to dive into this bad boy. So this is the cinnamon square. Uh, obviously, you guys can see the marbling here on the side with the brown sugar, uh, cinnamon butter, and then a light, little bit of light cream chisel right on top. And you guys know I like it. I like it light. All right, let's get in here. We'll do a little square. We'll do a square within the square. Oh, good marbling on top. We already got we already got some of that good good underneath. Mmm, it's still a little warm too. Well, this was worth it. Mmm. Excuse me. Excuse me. Having a moment here. 
Mm. Come on, let me get that perfect bite. There it is. A little bit of everything on there. Oh man. You know those days when you're just home? Sometimes it's a rainy day. Sometimes it's a snowy day, a cold day. And you just want like, like Cinnabons or something. Oh, and you make them at home and they come out nice and toasty like this. Woo, it's a little bit of nostalgia. That one's recommended. All right. And by the way, stick to the end of this video. We're gonna explain a little bit about the couple things that I brought up in the beginning of the video. This, my friends, is probably one of my dreams. You know, they always tell you like, hey, what is like 10 things that you would want on a deserted island? And, a, whoa, she's so, she's so heavy. This is a chocolate chip and you guys know how I feel about chocolate. But there's something about chocolate and peanut butter that when you put it together. Oh, that's how. <sighs> Excuse me. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Just let that marinate. Let that peanut butter just move in. Move into the mouth. Get a little condo. Oh yeah, get a little condo on the roof of your mouth. Let it live there for a little bit. It's like peanut butter and jelly. It's like ketchup and mustard. It's like the sun and the moon. Wait, that doesn't make sense, Lupe. Come on. I know it's early in the morning, but keep it together, pal. All right, one more bite. Oh boy. Wow, that is rich. And then last but not least, people go crazy for this. This has a cult following, man. Red Velvet. Nothing really needs to be said about this bad boy right here. White chips. Everybody knows the rules. Mm. White chips lighten it up a little bit. Ooh. I don't know what's, let me see if I can do it this way. Uh, oh my. I should have been eating them this way. I would have had a, like a little bib. Rookie mistake. All right, guys, I'm going to go down the hatch here. Uh, you know, I know we started this kind of the rating thing where we would choose our favorites. Um, you know, a bunch of other channels started doing it, too. So that's awesome. <clears throat> Sharing is caring. So uh, let's just do number four. Red Velvet. I like it. I have to be in the mood for it like anything else in life. It's good. Um, number three is going to be that maple one. I'm telling you, it's going to trick you. And also, if you want a power move, if you're if you're at like... If you're home and you're just chilling at La Casa, Ladybug on our windshield here. That is good luck. Thank you. Love you too. Uh, put a little dollop. You can do what you want in life. Hold on. There's a little bit of this right here. Let's call it my name. Mm, looking right at me. Number two, believe it or not, this week is going to be the peanut butter. And you guys, you guys know me. Usually I add peanut butter as number one. And then, uh, yeah, I mean, the, the cinnamon is cinnamon's where it's at but um yeah so that's this week's review um for everyone else for the roadie foodie fam uh hang tight a little bit uh but for everyone else thanks for checking us out uh we're starting a second channel all the information will be down below if you want to go check that out uh, thank you for chilling with us that one and i'll, I'll get into it now that one is going to be a little bit more lifestyle that one's going to be a little bit more 
I was trying to figure out a way how to segment the two things. And by the way, I'm going to talk about this all week. So I'm probably going to repeat myself is um, I'm trying to separate the two. The one that's like local food, right? Like crumble. Crumble is probably going to follow us over uh, to the other channel. And then that way, Rhode Foodie stays more Rhode Islandy. Does that make sense? More Rhode Island, New Englandy, local, local, local. So Crumble's been uh, really good to us. You know, they sent us a swag bag a couple times back uh, back in the day. They sent us some uh, some some birthday love back in the day. Um, so you know, and plus they're fun. Let's be honest. They're, they're just, it's a, it's a fun little thing. Um, so that's what we're gonna do. That uh, the new chat the the second channel. Cause I have to, I have to say that cause everyone that I was talking to, they're like, you're done with the roadie. No, no, no. It's just a second channel as we're trying to navigate our ecosystem. So what that, what basically that means is that the second channel is going to be more, um, a little bit of food, but not too much. Um, it's going to be a little bit more lives over there. Um, it's going to be a little bit more, uh, social over there. Um, it's going to be a little bit more travel as you guys know. Uh, we're going to be going to uh, Tennessee real soon um, to look at land. And if we decide to pull the trigger on that, um, we will now have some off-grid land, uh, raw land in Tennessee in order to have some fun. So I kind of want to document that over there. Uh, that has nothing to do with like kind of the Rhode Island food. So if you guys could do me a favor, the faster we can get to 1,000 subscribers on that channel, the faster I can go live, if that makes any sense. It's like YouTube's little rules. So uh, follow us over there. Uh, we won't be posting there for like probably another week or so. So if you're like, oh, we're just subscribing, what the heck? I might do a little short or something, but um, go follow us over there. And then secondly, this week, the reason why we're doing free food week here and, and, and kind of emptying a lot of our reward points is because I just noticed the other day because um, I had checked it like a week or a half prior and I went onto my McDonald's app and I was like oh you know what maybe I'll use some of my points and I noticed like a third of them were gone and I was like what the beep is going on here so some apps and I don't think Crumble does this and I don't think Duncan does this but some apps you got to read the fine print the McDonald's app, your reward points get tossed out the door a year from when you earn them. So, you know, my thought process was, and I don't know why I thought this, I was like, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to save up all my points and then maybe like a future video idea would be, let's see if we can eat for free on um, app reward points for a month. Again, that's not going to happen now because some of the apps are a little bit of, uh, como se dice, uh, shady. No, I'm just kidding. It's their rules. They can make what they want. But it sucks that some companies say, hey, Crumble Cash, you can keep that for life. Hey, Dunkin' Reward Points, you can keep that for life. And then some say, we think one year is, uh, is, is good. It's good enough. So that's why we're going to be doing. And the dreaded, and I want to use the points because I don't want them... I don't want them to get over a one-on-one -on -one of us is I will be filming at the dreaded BK and that's only because I want to use the points and I don't want them to I don't want them to have them I don't want you to have my points so we're gonna go there we're gonna figure out you know it, this is their chance this is their chance to either I mean they already had the last nail in the coffin but this is like their last chance to I don't know. So this is kind of the fun that we're gonna have this week with some of the uh, some of the national uh, folks. Um, but yeah, still join us here, guys. We're still gonna be doing uh, uh, all the foodie stuff here as well. We're gonna do a little bit of foodie stuff on the second channel. Again, all that information is down in the description. Uh, tell everyone, you know, if if you know subscribers that are part of our channel that you see them on in, in another channel's like little uh, situation, tell them, hey. Loops got a second channel, more lifestyle, everything. It's basically going to be the be the best way of saying it is here. Roadie foodie it has two words, right? Road roadie for Rhode Island and foodie for food. So Rhode Island foodie. So what we're going to do is we're going to open up the floodgates over there. All right. All right, guys. Love you guys. Thank you so much. 
And until next time, be well, eat well, and make sure you guys take care of each other, okay? And we'll probably keep that one. Or either that we need a new sign off. Or maybe I'll just say love ya. Mwah. Uh, we'll figure it out.